Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Humbled Mumbles, coming back to you with another music video reaction. I have some news for you. 1,800 subscribers. We hit 1,800 on our way to 1,900, then on our way to 2,000, then on our way to a cabillion. Oh, my goodness. It's just around the corner. Just kidding. I don't even know how much is in a cabillion. Just a whole bunch of cuz, I think. But um, keep it up. I love it. Keep bringing me those subs. Keep bringing me those comments. Keep bringing me those likes. I mean, bring the dislikes too. Help me improve my channel. Check out my Patreon in the link in the description. Uh, come join my patrons. They're soon about to receive videos that are not going to be on YouTube. Um, especially the ones that I have to chop up like crazy to put on here. I hate doing it, but it is what it is. Uh, Got to avoid those copyright strikes. And um, thank you. Thank you for your support. You patrons, thank you so much for your support. I can't thank you enough for how phenomenal you guys are. What we have here today is we have Baby Metal, Starlight, um, from their world tour in Japan extra show, Dark Knight Carnival. <laughs> okay. Um, S29. What is it? Season 20? I don't know what that means. Either way, it's Baby Metal. They put on a good show. They have lots of energy. And I like it. They rock. You know what I mean? They're, they're upbeat. Let's, let's check it out. Here we go. Baby Metal. Starlight. There's five of them on stage now, and I do remember hearing something in the comments hearing. Yeah, I hear my comments. My comments talk to me. But um, reading something in the comments about how they did some shows with five girls, and this is cool, so now I get to see it. So they're, they're trying something new, and I, get, I, and I guess you guys also said they went back to three. So maybe this is a cool experiment, and I guess what they did was, so correct me if I'm wrong in the comments, with the, with, instead of rotating those girls for that third spot or whatever, they just decided to put them all on stage at one time just to see how it went. You know, that's how it looks. So that's kind of cool. Let's keep it going. And their outfits have changed. You know, they're, they're doing that whole, like, black and gold look now instead of the black and red. And I hope, I hope I get to see some of the band. Are they differently? Uh, are they dressed differently, too? Their band is so phenomenal. They rock. Okay, that was really cool the way it was like she's got her like, you know, they're a little bit more high pitched than some most singers and they got their 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 tone and all of a sudden you hear the you know the the low stuff and then they come right back in with the high stuff. So that's a nice little blend. I like that. That blend was pretty cool. We'll go back to 45. Maybe we can catch that. And what I've also noticed too is that they're definitely got like a more I don't know if mature is the word you want to use. Um, oh, there's the band. Okay, I see some band in the background. That's cool. They got a little bit more mature look to them, more dark, more, I don't know, sinister, not really, but you guys get what I'm saying. Um, you know, with their with their eyeliner and the way their makeup's looking, and I don't see many smiles, but that's, that's the performance they're giving. All right, let's keep going. Whoa, what did she just do? What was that? That looked like something. Whatever that person did with their body did not look natural. Okay, I th something just hit me. Does this does this tie into their 
what video was it? Did this tie into their, let's see, distortion? So is this kind of a, a, on their graphic novel? You know their graphic novel that they have where they've got like the seven, like, oh man, I can't remember what you guys told me. Not the seven deadly sins. It's like the seven heroes or the seven, not gods, but I don't remember. So this probably ties into that. Did this, does this video come before that one? Because of distortion, the entire like, wherever they were, the entire city, state, whatever, was totally destroyed, you know, by those beasts. And then, is this pre-fight? So many questions. I want to check out the graphic novel, though. I'm going to try to find it. I think I answered my own question in the video. Uh, well, they answered my question. In the video, there's a guy, and he was pulling down that, like, bone mask. Um, he's in the distort... Or is it he? Anyways, that hero, god, whatever, um, is in the distortion video, too. So that is kind of cool, too, how it's all tied together. So I'm wondering if there's a lot more videos out there, and if I should really sit down and watch these in order to really understand the story. Hmm. This is cool. I like when there's stories behind the videos. I, I don't like the videos that are just videos for fluff. And, and that's why I think that's why MTV really went the way they went. You know what I mean? They just turn into garbage because all these videos they were promoting were just garbage. I like substance in my videos. Okay, so we got some English going now. That's nice. Uh, forever we will always be with you. We will never forget your sunlight. Is that what they said? Your star, your shine sun. Okay. There's just something about that. That's probably my favorite part in music is when there, there'll be some lyrics and there'll be some singing and then the drums will come in, you know, cause it's a buildup and then all of a sudden it'll just hit hard. And I think that's just, that's my favorite part of music. I think to me, cause you're just waiting for it and you know, it's coming. And then when it hits, it's like, ah, satisfaction. That was live, it looked like, but that was only three of them. So this is not really a compilation, but it's a video. It didn't say anything about being a compilation, but I see only three on stage right now. It's a totally different venue, which I get it. Um, and I know some of you guys are saying the compilation videos suck, but I think this one's a little different because it's also mixing in like their music videos and all that. But man, that got loud, didn't it? Didn't that get like loud and just almost uncomfortable in my ears, in your ears? You know? That was really cool. And they're about to get some, they're good. Yep. That was really cool. That was nice. Uh, it had a nice sound to it, right? And the mixture of the nice high 
you know, tone, poppy voice kind of. It's not, I mean, it's not really poppy, but you guys get what I mean. Mixed in with the metal. Uh, it's nice. I like that. Listen, Baby Metal, they put on a good show. They did. Um, and they do, I mean. And uh, that was pretty cool to see. And I'm going to check out that. Check out their, their their graphic novel, I guess. It, it has all that stuff about their seven heroes or seven warriors or something like that. Seven deities. I don't even know. Um, that's really cool. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. I enjoyed it a lot. The name is Humbled Mumbles. Um, check out my Patreon page and join my patrons. Um, you know, so thankful for you guys. My wife and I thank you so much. Hit that subscribe button and keep those subscriptions coming. I can't believe we hit 1,800 subs. Let's keep this thing going. Um, drop some comments. I try to respond to all you guys' comments. And hit that like button. The like button is super important because it'll put my video on other people's like suggested list or recommended you know list. And you know that helps the channel grow. So I hope you guys have a beautiful day. You know, just uh, you know, stay safe. And until next time, goodbye.